Phew. That should do it, right? So, where's this key we're looking for? Did it dropped somewhere? I don't see anything of the sort so far. Hold up! I've got a reading! This is what was shining? Um, these aren't keys, though. Yep, no mistaking it. Those are bandages. <laughs> really? Sorry, but could I see those for a moment? What the? Who could that be this late in the evening? Come in. There you are. I heard I'd find you here. Huh? You look fine, more or less. Hmm? I'm sorry, but I don't believe we've met. Perhaps you're mistaking me for someone else. No, you're definitely who I've been looking for. Toshiro Kasukabe, Mr. Class President. Well, I suppose you're not mistaken then. What did you need to discuss with me? <laughs> Relax. No need to be so formal with me. It's not like I have to have a reason to be here. This is the student council room, and I am a student. <laughs> you have an upperclassman uniform, but I haven't seen you here before. Are you a new transfer? All business, aren't you? You got me, though. I already knew this school was fancy, but they push the decorum here pretty hard, don't they? pick it up eventually, and if not, then no biggie. I got curious about you, so I started asking around. Pretty impressive rep you've got there. A ton of talent, a connected family, stellar grades, your whole future set up. You even got elected student council president as a first year. Nobody done that here before you. Why are you describing me to myself? Is this some kind of awkward ribbing? If you don't have any council business, please see yourself out. I'm quite busy here. Oh, sorry if I upset you. I I'm just interested in you, I swear. I mean, getting beat up by a whole gang of delinquents? They don't even do that in manga anymore. Uh -huh. So you saw that? I even thought for a second that I'd find you here all covered in bandages. What a bizarre way of thinking. Still, you jumped into that mess by yourself all to help that other student getting mugged, didn't you? You're not just a president. You're a student council superhero. You know, I actually like the sound of that. <sighs> I wasn't doing anything so noble. I merely happened on the scene. Once I knew what was going on, I had no choice but to get involved. I also only became student council president because it'll look good on my college application. Besides, my father told me I need experience as a public figure to ensure I can take up the family's work. But never mind all that, I'm digressing. What I mean to say is I've learned a valuable lesson about poking my nose into other people's business. Huh. Still, you ended up rescuing the kid, right? Well, those miscreants seemed too tired to go back to bullying him once they had their fill assaulting me. Don't you have somewhere to be? It's well past time for students to still... Oh, right. I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Eri Natsuhara. Nice to meet ya. Kasukabe-kun, I've got a hunch about you. This is where you usually hang out after school, right? I'll drop by and bug you again later. Huh? See ya! <sighs> oh, my bad. I meant to give you this earlier. Here. See ya! What are... Some bandages? <sighs> what is with that girl?
Yeah. I bet we saw the same thing. I still can't wrap my head around it, though. Hmm. <laughs> no doubt about it. That was so full of twists, I don't even know where to start. <laughs> oh, Futaba, same, same with me right now. Same with me. <sighs> I just want to go home. But whatever. That was Toshiro in the uniform, yeah? The student council president? Yes, yes, Ryuji. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised this school has to do with Toshiro. Obviously, it has to do with something with Toshiro. I'm not even surprised. Not even surprised at all. Last two worlds, it's just been about Toshiro so far. Oh, but anyways. Hmm. He hasn't even changed a bit. <laughs> standoffish than usual i don't know futaba he's still <laughs> he's still pretty much standoff right more standoff right now i mean whatever you get the point it's like he was even more uptight than he is now <laughs> but it looks like he's never been much of a fighter huh indeed it's safe to say he's grown to become one of those types who favors nagging over physical conflict couldn't you just have called it dialoguing? It <laughs> There's something more important to discuss now. Good point. Now that we have what seems to be the key in this place, we can get out of here. <laughs> yep. We'll have plenty to talk about on the other side of the door. Exactly. I feel like we, yeah, we should get out of here. For more of those hell spawn legionnaire spawns in. wasn't a figment of our imaginations. You mean, we witnessed something that actually took place? Yes, I'm sure of it. Although, I'd forgotten the event entirely until now. The girl who showed up was Eri Natsuhara. She was one of my senpai on the student council. But out of all my life, why that memory? Beats me, Toshiro. Hmm... Uh, well, maybe because of this kingdom, obviously. Yeah, I'd say that sounds right. This place does resemble a school in some ways. If you added a bunch of weird stuff to one. Toshiro, have you remembered anything else yet? Well, that was when I first met Natsuhara Senpai. She joined the council shortly after, and... She had you totally whipped! <laughs> That's an awful way to put it, but it's unfortunately not far from the truth, either. Regardless, she was also the kind of person who couldn't stand mistreatment or injustice. Whenever she caught wind of problems with the school or students in trouble, she'd run to me with a report. Every time, she would try to convince me with a Toshiro, let's fight the good fight. I initially agreed to help so I could keep tabs on her. She was such a reckless student council member. Before I knew it, she had us running all over the school together. We tackled all sorts of issues at that school. Bullying, unfair school rules. Heck, by the end, we were even giving career and relationship advice. At some point, the student council room became more of a counseling room for the average student. <laughs> counseling room. <laughs> the students kind of were always grateful whenever we were able to help them. I found that especially gratifying, since I was fed up with my father's alternative expectations for me. Looking back at the time, I think we did a lot of good together. And then... <sighs> and let me guess, you forgot to that point, Toshiro. That's all I'm able to remember. Why? Oh, uh, not surprised, not surprised. Uh, I can't. It's like something's fogging my memory. Oh, uh, let me guess. We're gonna have to find some of these memorable items for you to remember fully again, huh, Toshiro? Hey, don't push it too hard. Yeah, calm down, Toshiro. We all shared that vision when you touched the bandage. That's what restored your memory. 
There are supposed to be four keys, right? Maybe we can learn more from finding the others. True. And there are still a few more things I want to get to the bottom of. Especially about Natsuhara Senpai. And you as well, Irina. There's a bit too much resemblance for it to be a coincidence, huh? Totally. They even have the same chemistry together. <laughs> I think so. I, I mean, we may look similar, but I don't boss you around that much. Right, Toshiro? <laughs> really? What do you expect to say? <laughs> uh, it's more like he's in the palm of your hand and you're crushing him. Yeah, as flat as a pancake. What? Well, is that really how you all see me? <laughs> I have to admit, though, there's one thing that's been stuck on my mind. It's been nagging me ever since we came to this world. When I saw the visions of Toshiro's memory, I felt something stirring in my own head. Hmm. What's stirring your head, Arena? Please share. That girl. She's someone from your own world, right? Hmm. Well, if... I guess, yeah. Ever since I heard we're in a world made from Toshiro's heart, I've been thinking. What am I, exactly? Well, Erina, that's the big question we want to find out. But, of course, we know that you're Erina, and that's all that matters. <laughs> Arena. I have a few ideas I could share, but nothing for certain. Ultimately, I have a feeling you're entirely different from any of the entities we're familiar with. I see. Hmm. Don't worry, Erina, we'll know, we'll know soon enough. No matter what I turn out to be, in the end, I'm still me. Heck yeah, exactly, Arena. That's why I like to hear. Nailed it! No matter what you are, you'll always be you. Just like Mona will always be a cat, eh? Yeah, keep the cat. <laughs> oh, we're gonna never change, huh? No use thinking about it now. How about we get back to it? <laughs> We've still got three more things to find, right? That is correct. Yep, now that we've got the one, let's head back to the Rebel Club room next. Alright, to the LeBlanc. Yeah, especially since we can assume another fight's waiting for us behind the next door. Let's head back and find out where the next one is. <laughs> Oh, we're all this quest already. All right. Um, let me see. Um, you know what? Hey, I'm gonna stop it right here, guys. Alrighty. Um, next part in Persona Five Tactica. Uh, oh yeah, there's new quests now. Actually, actually, I'm gonna check out the quest real quick. Um, yeah, there's actually one new quest. Or you know what? Whatever. You know what? I'll do one more. I'll do... Yeah, whatever. I'll play the new quest, and then I'll stop. Wait, I forgot how to... No. <laughs> Oops. Okay, yeah, I'll do one more. I'll do another quest. Or one side quest, and that'll be it. So what let's do choose? this. A balancing axe. Haru asks Yosker to help with manuring around her axe. Oh, I guess it's training day or training time for Haru, huh? Let's see what this is about. Okay, Yolsker and Haru defeat four enemies, or defeat four enemies, defeat enemies in four turns. Okay. Okay. This this should be an easy mission. It's not one of those be the, be everything in one turn mission. Hey. Sure, Haru. What's up? Hmm? Oh, we're asking Yosuke. So that's it. Mm. I mean, that is true. It's a lot of... Honestly, those two weapons are pretty heavy weapons. Huh. <laughs> Throw your axe around it, no. I don't know. Um, 
How about... Uh, but you're fine as you are, though. Thank you. And of course, ignore the you. Please pretend that's an O. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, I get it. <laughs> oh boy, Yosuke. I hope you have a good idea. <laughs> Good idea. Oh, I see. Hmm. Of course. And me too, Haru. I'll help you out too. <laughs> oh boy, Oscar. I'm I'm worried what your plan is. Oh boy. Okay. All right. I'm in I'm in the battle. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. I, well, okay, let's do this. All right, Haru, it's training time. Black hole nor. <laughs> Here doesn't matter. Mm. Just beat him up like always. Behold my power. No. Huh, I'm trying to think. Persona. No. Okay, I have to think here. Hit the other me. Oh. Wait, but then... Oh, but they're gonna go along the wall. Yeah, you know what? I might as well... You'll skirt. Wait, I have an idea. Boom! I have an idea. I'll shoot the big guy, Yosker. Actually, yeah, I'll shoot the big guy. Fire! I'm perfectly ready. There, now kill him. Yeah! I am now. Um. Do that, Yosker. Okay, we have three turns left. Okay, we gotta hurry, guys. Darn it. Wait, can you shoot for- oh no, of course she can't. No, I'm gonna have to do that. Oi! What to do here? Darn it! Oh, it's fine, I'll kill this. I'll kill this guy. Die! There we go. And then Yosker, go down there. Nice. Heck yeah. Um. Oh wait. Oh. Heck yeah, Yosker, you're kicking butt. <laughs> uh, well, wait, man, Yosker, calm down. <laughs> Yosker, calm down. We're supposed to be training Haru. <laughs> you're, you're doing all the work! Yosker! <laughs> Darn it, Yosker. Great. This training was supposed to be Haru's training. I'll do my best. Great, now Haru's just, Haru's just gonna kill this last guy. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Haru didn't even get much training. <laughs> Yosker did all the work. Darn it, Yosker, I knew your plan wasn't gonna be good. Instead of training Haru, you ended up training yourself a lot. Darn it, Yosker. 
<laughs> oh my gosh. Um, uh, yeah, yay, or you did it, you killed them all. <laughs> Even though, uh, Yosuke did all the work. That's great. <laughs> I'm curious too. But hmm, open affection wasn't easy for him. He let you get away with it. Uh, I guess open affection wasn't easy for him. Indeed. Skirt. I didn't even learn any- I mean, okay, fine, I did learn from Haru a bit about her past, but... Yosuke, this is supposed to be Haru's, okay, Haru's training. Uh, you know, whatever. Okay. Uh, I guess if, as long as Haru learns something, then I'm alright with it. <laughs> <laughs> Why hold your- you mean black hole noir, you skirt? Oh. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. Okay. Alright guys, that's going to be it for Persona 5 Tactica. If you like what you see, feel free to subscribe to my channel. And if you do want to support it, then feel free to subscribe. If you don't want to, then that is understandable. But, yeah, so far, I'm liking the series. And I'm going to continue to play this game till the very end. Of course, I'm going to be playing the DLC too, so stay tuned for that. Until then, this is Jokestar45. And I'll see you in the next Persona 5 Tactica. See ya.